session, we have discussed about what do we mean by potential divider and the classification of potential divider. We understood the importance of potential divider very clearly. But while doing measurement by using potential divider, there will be some errors which will be occurring because of some reasons. Now let us discuss what are the reasons for occurrence of error in the potential divider measurement. That means causes for error in potential dividers. As you can see, there are ma four major reasons which will be causing error in potential divider. The first reason is residual inductance. Residual inductance is not desirable for any type of measurement. It will be excess of inductance because of some reasons additional inductance will be added up. Because of the residual inductance, you will be getting the wrong reading. Your reading will be varied. That is the main problem for residual inductance. Unwanted inductance which will be adding in the measurement device or measurement method. That is known as residual inductance. Similarly, the second reason is stray capacitance. What do we mean by stray capacitance? It is also known as parasitic capacitance. Stray capacitance can be called parasitic capacitance. The reasons for formation of stray capacitance is because of connecting leads. Especially if you talk about some switches. So that is also responsible for getting wrong reading in case of potential divider measurement. So while doing the design, you need to consider stray capacitance, residual capacitance, residual inductance, etc. Third one is impedance error due to connecting leads between the divider and the test object. Obviously, you need to connect the low voltage arm to the measurement device. In between, you, need, you require connecting leads or connecting wires. So uh, the impedance of the connecting errors that will be causing errors that may cause certain voltage drop Okay among the total voltage that voltage drop should be reduced So because of the connecting leads there will be impedance that impedance will result certain drop and uh, you will be getting a uh, wrong reading So that is the third reason because of impedance error uh, some amount of voltage will be reduced. There will be a drop for certain amount of voltage. Now moving on to fourth reason. Parasitic oscillations due to lead and cable inductance and capacitance of HV terminals to ground. So this parasitic oscillations is some, some sort of vibration uh, that will be causing errors in case of potential divider measurement. These are the four major reasons which will be causing errors in potential divider measurement. While doing design or while doing calibration, you need to take care of those four errors. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you found this channel useful, please do subscribe. Thank you.